So the day has come, um, one year after speaking to Nemanja. I'll be there in a few minutes. So super excited to see what's happening over here at Europe's first LFP Giga Factory. Where? Either your collar or your jacket. Right, let's go. Just hop on. Good, good, good. <laughs> so all of this will be teared down, yeah. but that part stays and will be renovated. Ah. They're not rep representative, yeah. <laughs> he say he says that don't record too much their workers, they're not very representative. Yeah. <laughs> uh, okay, we can have a walk here. We're back after a quad quad ride around the uh, the factory. I think I think I might be one of the first people who get a quad factory tour. Yeah. Uh, so that was really fun. Uh, but back to business, uh, we are now at the uh, site of the the micro pilot, right? The mini pilot. The mini pilot, yes, that's correct. And it's a construction area now. This is the the intended location. Yeah. And being built out now, and yeah, you know, so many things. I can hear all the construction behind. There's loads of uh, people working on the site. Uh, what's happening today? In in what is it? September 2022. Yeah, so we're, we're full power in construction. The equipment is being finalized and being shipped, actually. Some of it is already being shipped and we expect it to arrive in December. And uh, we're basically gonna start operations from January. So this thing, what you see today, in three, four months from today, it's going to be a, a working mini pilot facility where all the researchers and also some scale up production people will be working and making uh, Europeans first LFP batteries. And this whole space around us yeah. will be the Giga Factory, right? This is Giga, yeah, this is Giga one. one. Giga One, correct. So we plan to, like, there to build a pilot plant, which will be 500 megawatt hour pl pilot plant, mm -hmm. and then uh, here will be used for Giga One. Right now, it's a, uh, it's an old building from a, from a meat factory which went bankrupt, but we plan to refurbish it and renovate it, mm -hmm. and then have it ready for 2025. Okay. Once all of this is is done, what? What will 11S be, be supplying to the market and where do you see you know, uh, 11S being from there, going off from there? So you'll be seeing uh, 11S batteries in um, electric vehicles, in mainly entry level electric vehicles, but also some others, in some buses, mm -hmm. in some trucks, and in large utility energy storage applications, and maybe even some home applications. Mm -hmm. So it's quite a wide range where you're gonna see 11S batteries. Amazing. And then Giga 1, Giga 2, and who knows? Yeah, basically the future is, is very bright and it's very challenging and it's very interesting. And Giga 1 will be supplying already enough for, I think, uh, 250,000 cars. Mm -hmm. So it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a big achievement. Yeah. And the Giga 2 will, will be announced next year, but it's, it's going to be about a million vehicles, probably. Ooh. Yeah, amazing. so it, it's really, really amazing, amazing what's being built here. And we're looking forward to it. I'm, I'm yeah. really excited to be here. Yeah. Well, thank you so much, Nemanja, for, for having me here, for taking me around the factory and for introducing the 11S team uh, to me as well. It's been, it's been a pleasure. Thank you. And all thank the best to 11S. Thank you very much. And I uh, hope to see you in the future when everything is working. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I would love to be back. I would love to be back.
All right, thank you for tuning in and take care. Bye bye. Bye. And uh, we were then doing a lot of uh, research and studying and saw that actually like a third or even, even more of the process is very similar to what we do. Mm-hmm. <laughs>